This video compares AI models of 32 billion parameter size, which is quite popular among business users because it offers a balance of cost and performance. If you are looking to implement an AI model for your business, this video would be helpful. This is Fahad Mirza and I welcome you to the channel. The models which I am going to compare in this video are DeepSea Car 1 Distilled Coin 32 billion, Kaiworks OR1, GLM Rumination Coin 32 billion in Vision, QWQ and I will also be mentioning few more models. Now the reason why I have selected these models is not out of some bias but on the basis of the real world experience I have while implementing these models on various clients and for various business use cases. I already have covered all of these models on my channel. We have installed them locally, we have fine tuned them locally and we have used them for various agentic, for RAG and for coding and other purposes. So after watching this video, if you feel that any model suits your business needs, then just search on my channel and you should be able to find a related video of that model where you will also find some architectural detail. So let's get started and we will start our comparison. This first table is a sort of your model at a glance guide. It quickly tells you each AI's parameter count, architectural touch points like whether it includes a vision transformer or uses any new training trick. It is also very very data set focus. It also shows you max context window as how much data at any given point in time a model can process and then very importantly licensing information. Now this is where you have to be very very careful especially if you're a business user. If you're implementing an AI model make sure that you're aware of all the license nuances and I would highly suggest that if you have a budget engage some uh, contract and license specialist to read through these licenses. Normally Apache 2 license is my preferred one because it is the most permissive one out there. Almost all of these models which I am co covering are Apache 2 or similar so they are safe for most commercial enterprise and professional usage. Normally when I am confused I normally go with Quen's model which are Apache 2. And one of the model which I have used most is QWQ32 billion but again that is very highly dependent on the use cases. Okay next up this table gives you an overview of reasoning and coding capabilities. Now given the size of these 32 billion the thing which, ha which has changed in the last 6 months is around reasoning. Most of the models which come in 32 billion size either are totally or purely reasoning model or they offer a way to toggle it on and toggle it off. Reasoning and coding skills define this model group here. So for example if you look at this table, DeepSeq R1 Distill and Skywork OR1 stand out in math and coding specifically for their reinforcement learning driven reasoning breakthroughs. Then this new model which has just arrived like I think last week and GLM Z1 rumination adds rumination or multi-step deep thought prompting with research style retrieval and complex task solving. So if you have a very very complex coding or math problem, I would highly suggest first give this GLM Z1 a try. Then we have this Quen 2.5 VL which brings strong reasoning and coding with a tilt to vision challenges and tool using agent scenarios. So if you have your math problem or coding problem somehow embedded in your tables or equations or something like that, this is a very good choice in my humble opinion when it comes to a free model. QWQ32 billion Quen with thinking is a general reasoning uh, beast competitive with bigger closed models for hard tasks and we have seen it when we installed it locally and we played around with it and I have done heaps of videos. I even did a video where we run it, ran it on the CPU. There was a way you can search it on the channel but if you are confused you don't know which model to run QWQ normally is a safe pet in this model family. 
and one more thing i want to highly stress ai is at bleeding edge it is changing every day maybe every hour so what i am telling you right now might not be valid next week next month next year so keep following the channel because i also do the iterations of these comparisons because things are changing so fast but as of now as we speak i believe from the real world pers perspective cutting through all the hype these are the models for these tasks at the moment okay now we know a bit more about uh, these sort of stuff so let's check out now this training and optimization and i want to spend a bit of a time here so this table spotlights what makes this model tick under the hood beyond just data and size so if you see we have something called as rl used all these model often incorporate reinforcement learning to refine outputs beyond basic supervised learning all of these models apply rl in some way or another for example deep sea carbon distill is notable for its rl first cold start approach followed by multi stage rl and human alignment specifically for chain of thought and reasoning skywork over one uses a customized rule based rl system or grpo again leveraging difficulty aware sampling making its training more efficient and robust under challenging scenarios it's a very good quality model too as i said glm's model is distinguished by its deeper ruminative rl cycles guided by multi level reward functions and strong feedback loops simulating research grade thinking and if you look at quens model both of these integrate rl with standard supervised fine tuning method with qwq scaling rl for agentic tool use and towards the end of the video i'm also going to tell you a very closely kept secret from the um frontier labs around these 32 billion model so stay at the end and if you're liking the video please uh, click that like button okay so now we know a um, bit more about these models and uh, around their training if you look at the deployment and openness all of these models run locally on properly provisioned hardware some like skywork or one are exceptionally open code its code data set weight all out in the open when models are always available on hugging face model scope and everywhere and they play really good with community tool chains but if you're looking for to, true rep reproducibility and hackability skywork probably leads the pack and deep sea can glm part way are there now what are the recommended use cases look again this is very subjective so this is where you jump to which should i pick math heavy task go for skywork or deep sea carbon still doing serious programming either of these or glm need document parsing invoice analysis multimodal qa or any vision laden workflow give 2.5 vl uh, a chance for agent building complex research and logic heavy task glm set one rumination and qwq stand out and because of their multi stage reinforcement rumination and tool use a path now at the end of the day as i mentioned earlier these things are changing very very rapidly so we just have to be you know cognizant of this fact that we are aware that these comparison hold for a specific period of time their shelf life is not huge but i believe that these are one of the most few of the most promising options for local high performance language and vision reasoning so this video is aiming to clarify their strength technical differences and which one you might choose for various tasks now as i said you can search these models on the channel separately also if you are using any other model in this uh, size please share your experience in the comments as we are all learning together before i let you go i also want to uh, introduce you to the sponsors of the video who are camel ai camel is an open source community focused on building multi agent infrastructures for finding the scaling laws with applications in data generation task automation and world simulation thank you for watching if you like the content please consider subscribing and sharing it among your network thanks